guys welcome back to my channel today I've got my February favorites to share with you February has been a really really busy and crazy month for me but regardless it's been really good I love keeping busy so I've had a really good February I hope you have too I've got quite a few like beauty and hair care and like body products that I've just been loving this month so I'm just going to jump right in. So first off, I've got some makeup items to show you. And I have the Mega Plush Volume Express Mascara by Maybelline. And this is in the shade K103. It's like a really dark brown kind of shade. And the brush just looks like this. I'm actually wearing this one today. And it just gives you the most beautiful, like, natural, separated thicker kind of lashes and I just really love for the natural look. I'm not really into heavy makeup kind of look on a daily basis. If I'm going out or something I tend to put on a lot of makeup like a full face but on a daily basis I just like to wear a bit of mascara, maybe a little bit of lip gloss, nothing too much. So this is a really good nice natural one. The next makeup item I have to show you is a lip gloss by L'Oreal and I have this in the colour 601 Nude Ballet and the colour just looks like that. My hand. It's just a really nice sheer kind of colour with the also like a light kind of gloss. It doesn't feel sticky or anything on the lips. I am wearing it today. Um, it's just yeah, it's really nice and natural looking. It gives you like a your lips with better kind of look and it goes with like every lip colour as well. It goes really well with um, Velvet Teddy by MAC. I've been loving those two together. And yeah, it's just a really beautiful colour. So next up I've got some hair care items to show you. And I'm actually pretty lazy when it comes to like doing my hair in certain styles and stuff like that. I tend to leave it quite natural and just like pin it to the side or tie it back or just leave it out and sometimes I'll straighten it like maybe once every few months I'm really really bad with my hairstyles but I absolutely love hair care I use so many different products on my hair try to keep it really really healthy and just that's I think that's why I can leave it looking quite natural because it is quite healthy at the moment it's because I look after it as well as I do so one of the products that I've been loving at the moment is the Miracle Hair Treatment by Eleven. It just looks like that. This says that it adds shine, smoothness and softness, controls frizz and flyaways, moisturizes, strengthens fragile hair, whew, prevents split ends, detangles and create manageability, protect against heat styling, enhance natural body, repair dry damaged hair, protect hair color with uh, UVA and UVB filters prevent chlorine and sun damage. That is a mouthful, but I absolutely 100% believe that it does all of, if not most of the things that it says. I absolutely love this. I use it every time I wash my hair. Just put some in between your hands and you rub it and you sort of just rub it through the ends and I tend to put like whatever's left over on my hands through the rest of the tops of my hair because if you put too much on top it does get a little bit greasy but this is just such a beautiful product it smells amazing it smells like coconutty a little bit pineapple -y. it's just really really beautiful I got this um, actually I think in a lust habit box as like one of the deluxe samples but I think this is actually a full-size product and yeah I'm definitely oh, dropped it Whew. Yeah, definitely going to be repurchasing this one. The next item I've got to show you isn't necessarily a hair care item, but I do use it for hair care. And that is just a jar of organic coconut oil. This is by the brand Melrose. You just buy this from like a supermarket. It's, um, it's cold pressed. So cold pressed I know is a lot better than whatever the other type is. Um, just keeps the oil in its most natural form and it's better... Gives it a better product all round. Um, so this one, I actually use it every time before I wash my hair. I get a little bit and I rub it between my hands and then I massage it through my hair for about 10 to 15 minutes. Um, if I'm in a rush, maybe just like five minutes or I'll let it sit for a little bit and then you just wash it out with shampoo and conditioner and it like does leave your hair really oily. That's why I always do it before I wash my hair. But what I've noticed since I've started using it is that my hair is actually growing so much faster and it's growing a lot thicker and I've actually started spreading like all these tiny little baby hairs everywhere. 
And I've been doing this for about two months now and I've only just started to notice a difference. I think it's the kind of thing with your hair that it takes a little bit to get it healthy again and get things going. But since I've started using this, I absolutely love it. It doesn't smell or anything. It's just, yeah, it doesn't even smell like coconut. It's just like oil. You could probably use olive oil as well, but I prefer coconut oil. I think it's a little bit more gentle on the hair. And yeah, it's a really good tip if you suffer from like dry or damaged hair or you're suffering from a lot of hair breakage or hair loss. Because I used to be suffering from a lot of really bad hair loss and this has totally helped me. So now I've got some skincare items to show you and these are both by the brand La Roche Posay. I've got two products to show you by them. The first one is the Epiclar Duro Plus. Um, this is just like, what does it say? Corrective Unclogging Care anti imperfection Cream. So it's just a really light kind of... Um, Acne cream, I guess. It's also really good for like discoloration and stuff like that on your skin. You can use this one twice a day, like morning and night. I tend to use it like as a spot treatment, so I just put it on problem areas. But you can use this all over your face because it is really light and it's definitely great for sensitive skin, this one. And since I've been using it, I've noticed such a big difference. Like if I get a breakout or something, I just put a dollop of it on straight into the spot I let it sit overnight and I wake up and it's pretty much all dried out it's just a really really amazing product highly recommend this one and the next one I've got by that brand which I'm not going to try to say again is their EAU thermal oh that's in French thermal spring water for sensitive skin that's the English one um, so basically this is just one of those the like what are they called like spring water sprays and you just shake it up and spray it all over your face. You can use this one um, as like a makeup setting kind of spray, just set all the powders really nicely or you can just use it like I do on a pretty much daily basis where if I'm feeling really hot or a little bit dry in my skin I just give my face a spray. It, comes out a bit thick sometimes like it just did so you have to shake it quite a bit before you use it so it's more of like a fine mist but I've really really been enjoying this one especially since summer just ended in Australia so it's just really nice and refreshing especially if I was going to like the beach or something like that I love to just keep my bag I was like so addicted to this at one point I'm spraying it like 10 times a day and because it is for sensitive skin it doesn't like clog your skin or anything it just feels really, really nice and fresh. So next I've got some skincare items to show you. And the first one I've got, it's actually a sample size. I'm definitely going to go out and purchase the full size of this one now because I absolutely love it. And it is the Urban Skin Care Co. Infused Body Balm. Enriched with vitamin C, calcium and magnesium. Um, this is just a really, really lightweight, fresh kind of moisturizer. It smells so citrusy and so beautiful you can just use this all over your body or wherever you have a sort of dry skin I'd say it's like not good for really really dry skin because I find the thicker kind of moisturizer is better for really really dry skin but where you've just got like sort of normal to dry skin on your body it's really really good I use this on my like chest and on my back and on my arms um, yeah, because I've got quite sensitive skin in those areas. I found that this doesn't break me out or anything, and I've just really been loving that one. So the next product I've got to show you is from Lush, and this is all I've got left of it. Um, it's called the Buffy Body Butter, and it says, This exfoliating bar from Lush will keep your cheeks peachy smooth in the sun. To use, melt in the shower, then apply all over body for smooth skin. So basically this is kind of like a bar of soap, but kind of not. So you use it as like a bar of soap. So you went underwater and you just rub it all over your body. But this one actually has really tiny little bits of like nuts or something in it that exfoliate your skin as you use it. So I'd say you probably use this one like once a week. I wouldn't recommend using it more than that because it can feel a bit harsh on your skin. But it's just such an amazing product, like I absolutely hands down, like are, I'm just in love with it, it's so good. So basically the way I use it is I just wet it, rub it all over my body and then I get out of the shower, 
and then I just sort of pat the excess product into my skin because it actually works not as just like a cleaning product but as a moisturizer as well so if you don't wash it all off once you finish showering and you sort of tap it into your skin it leaves your skin feeling really smooth and like hydrated and it's just such a beautiful product it is a little bit pricey um how much was it it was $14 for quite a small little block and it does tend to wear out quite quickly that's why I generally say to use it once a week but it's just such a beautiful product it's totally worth the money and yeah so that's all for me today guys thank you so much for watching I hope that you enjoyed I'd love to know what some of your favorites of February have been um, as always I'd really love it if you gave this video a big thumbs up and subscribed you can also check me out on Instagram and Twitter. I'm at Odette underscore Victoria on both those places. I'll leave links below as always. So I hope you guys have a beautiful day and I'll see you soon. Bye.